Hello and welcome. My name is Greg Anderson, and I want to walk you through a quick preview of our newly launched attack surface management solution. At Sprocket Security, we believe that attack surface management is a core competency of performing continuous offensive security. Let's take a look at why that is. Our ASM solution focuses on the same automated reconnaissance and enumeration capabilities as real world attackers, allowing us to get the full picture of your total attack surface as it expands and grows, as well as any changes that occur to existing technologies that we're aware of. Additionally, we're able to uncover weaknesses that may be missed by traditional vulnerability management capabilities simply because they're not designed to detect these type of exposures. Most importantly, I'm going to show you how you can go from detection in ASM to full attack path validation with CPT. So let's take a look at the platform. Once you log into the platform, you're going to be presented with the same dashboard that you know and love. What you'll notice, though, is on the left hand side navigation, you'll see this new section called attack surface. Hopping in here, you'll be able to see all the various pieces of information and technologies that make up your exposed attack surface. Here we're taking a look at just the domains that we've been able to uncover from the root domain that you've provided us uh, during onboarding or those IP blocks associated with your organization. If we do take a moment and drill into one of these, we can see all the DNS records associated with that domain. This is a great place to start to do some basic DNS auditing to see if you have any records that may no longer be in use and preventing yourself from being a victim of some subdomain hijacking if any of these point out to unused resources on shared hosting providers. Going a little bit deeper, we can also take a look at all of the exposed ports and services associated with those hosts on our perimeter. Looking at these just at first glance, we see a few things that are a little risky. We see that we've got some FTP open, we see we have some SSH that's accessible, um, but we also see here that we have 3306. Now this is a MySQL server. Um, I don't like that we're having this exposed on our perimeter when it's not behind anything. So let's take a look and see if there's any other exposures like this in our environment. Fortunately, this is the only one of these, but I still don't like it. So let's see if we can identify exactly what it's associated with. So we see the IP address. Now we can get a little deeper and see the ASN. This is actually associated with a GoDaddy record. And even further, we can just take it down to the exact domain name that we're actually associated with here. We don't stop at technologies with our ASM solution because users and email addresses also make up a portion of your attack surface. So here you're seeing all of these records that we were able to uncover using our automated reconnaissance capabilities. This allows you to get a quick glance at what you might be exposed to, as well as say, hey, maybe I wanna go a step further and actually request some custom testing that will allow us to do social engineering against these users that you've identified. Now, once again, taking you from identification with attack surface management to full attack path validation with our continuous penetration testing offering. Now, if that sounds like something interesting to you, I know this was just a short preview, please feel free to reach out to us and we'd be happy to show you how attack surface management can help your organization specifically. Thank you for your time.